both Leeds and Leicester got relegated on the final day of the season. Even though Leicester beat West Ham, it wasn't enough to stay up as Everton beat Bournemouth 1-0. I thought that Leeds were poor, to lose 4-1 and to concede so early in the game when you need to win, it's disappointing, especially against a poor Tottenham team that ended up finishing 8th, failing to qualify for Europe. I wasn't surprised that Leeds got relegated as they were in a similar position last year and they only managed to survive on the last day of the season when Burnley got relegated. I still think Burnley would have stayed up if they hadn't have sacked Sean Dice. However, I didn't think Leicester was going to get relegated, as they hadn't been in a relegation fight since the season before they won the title. I believe Leicester got relegated as they sold key players like Schmeichel and didn't replace them. However, when you look at their squad, they shouldn't have got relegated. Leicester are definitely going to get rated from other Premier League teams with players like Madison and Tillemans likely to leave. Everton managed to survive. It was more the same for Everton. They seemed to barely survive each year and I really question the board of Everton. How can a club as big as Everton and they spend so much money continue to get worse each year? They need to make smart settings in the summer as if they get relegated they will be in a lot of trouble with financial fair play due to the debt from their new stadium.